Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Miss Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we are doing Voltron Legendary Defender uh, Season 8, Episode 8 called Clear Day. So we're starting off with Anerva erase the guys in mind because in the last episode the one of the Altean um, pilots was going to interview Allura and then she kind of zapped his mind. And so, um, Pidge's dad isolated the thing that did that and put it in like in this huge container type thing. And then we cut to where a planet is celebrating Clear Day. And so, basically what happens is, <laughs> they contact the planet and the planet's like, we don't care that there's a war going on. We're celebrating Clear Day. So you can come and supervise, but we're having fun. So they actually decide to go there and have like a little bit of, um, of, of a break and actually have some fun there. And then we cut. So they go there and then Alora sees Lotor because she wasn't feeling too good because she felt like it was climbing to it. So she decided to take a nap. When she woke up, she saw Lotor. And he tells her to use the entity. And then she sees a vision of her using the road beast on Altea and actually destroying the actual planet. And then she wakes up and with like a cold sweat, like, like in a cold sweat, just like, oh my god, what's happening? Then we have Koran is um, beating, and so the rest of the people are on the planet, she decides to stay on the ship. And so Koran is um, beating this game, and then we have our wrestling for Shiro, and basically we have uh, uh, then Koran goes into some type of calling for some type of animal or something. It was really funny to watch. Then we have Keith and Hunk ride on a ride, and the ride stops. There was a malfunction. Then the Carney um, gyps. Uh, <laughs> Lance, <laughs> and then we cut to bad arm wrestling with Shiro, and he's like moving up through the score the scoreboard. And then we have Pidge gets tickets from parents or tokens from parents, so he can win something for Alora to cheer her up. Then Lutor uh, taunts Alora, and it works. And then we cut to the ride starts again, but then it stops. And it malfunctions again. And Lance had enough. Or, or Keith had enough. Yeah, Keith. He's like, no, nah, I cannot take this music any longer. But Hunk's like, duh, duh. You know, it's just going along with it. So he, they literally bust out and leave. And then we cut to where um, then the ride was fixed as they got off. And then, uh, and then we have a calling competition with Koran and he wins and then uh, Shiro is up against uh, the guy that was really really rough to them in the previous season I think it was either six or seven and the guy apologizes and thanks him because this is like his calling and stuff so he's actually really thankful for it and then they res they arm wrestle and then Shiro wins and then Alora um, passed out from absorbing the entity, and that is literally the end of the video. It was actually a pretty scary ending, actually. Like, really, really, like, crazy ending. But I really, really, really enjoyed it. And I'm saying way to me, stupid adjectives. Anyway, really good, um, episode. I gave this one an A. There was just, like, a couple key things. I was just like, eh, what else? But anyway, other than that, it was really, really good. Um, I like how they're all gathering to go to do stuff for Laura, make her feel better and all this type of stuff, but, uh, the way she just kind of went to the dark side a little bit was kind of crazy. I wasn't really expecting that, so that was pretty insane. Anyway, really, really, really good episode. I really enjoyed it, and that is going to do it for this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think down below. Are you happy I'm finally on a widescreen and not to where I was? on a vertical <laughs> so um i'll see y'all in my next video and i want you to have a super awesome day and don't forget to subscribe and i'll see y'all in my next video bye everybody